Uh, good afternoon, everyone. Yeah, I'm Liu Yun from Beijing Institute of Technology. I um, would like to give a brief uh, report on development situation, uh, issues, and uh, policy suggestions for Chinese female researchers. Uh, as we as we know as we know, uh, in the region of the global scale, uh, uh, in the past in the past uh, two decades, especially since 1990s, uh, uh, the number of the female researchers uh, uh, to participate in the s science and technology fields uh, keep uh, uh, growth uh, trend. Uh, the proportion of the world's, however, the proportion of the world's uh, women scientists is still less than uh, uh, less than a uh, certain one. On the other hand, with the uh, growth of the female education, jobs increased and enhanced the influence. However, the number of outstanding or prominent women scientists are less and less. For example, the female Nobel winners are only share uh, five point three percent of the total number of winners uh, since ninety uh, zero zero one, and the European Commission have just published the first she indicator in March uh, uh, twenty thirty, uh, which is shown that the uh, proper uh, proposition rate of Women researchers in U and U European Union science and engineering fields is only uh, 20, uh, 22 percent. In the related uh, industries fields of the largest R&D investment, the pro this proportion of the female researchers is only uh, uh, 90 percent. And uh, in recent years, the Chinese uh, academic scholar pay more attention to research on these topics about the development of the female researchers. Uh, for example, the uh, CAS, uh, uh, the Science and Technology Policy Institute of CAS uh, have uh, carried out the project situation study on Chinese women working in science and technology and uh, the Chinese woman and the science and technology development. And uh, the Chinese people uh, gender, uh, gender difference in achievement, motivation, and also the woman's subjective preference affect the uh, gender sa satisfaction of Chinese science and technology is uh, uh, typically investigation by the Chinese Science and Technology As Association. Uh, overall, uh, this uh, studies or lectures show that the lack of the comprehensive and uh, systematic study, both quali uh, quantitative and, and qualitative, about women researchers in China. Uh, uh, in, uh, in recent years, uh, and the Chinese governments and the Chinese association, and you, uh, especially the governments, uh, ha has has uh, uh, issued or publicated a series a uh, series of policies uh, uh, for the uh, female research, uh, researchers, uh, especially the according to the Science Technology Progress Law, uh, is revised in two thousand eight. I express that. The women researchers should enjoy the equal rights, and the set of serious policies that, uh, such as the promotion the career development of women researchers, especially senior female scientists, by the many uh, uh, governments of China. In 2011, uh, Ministry of Science and Technology of China and the NECWF uh, joined issued the opinion on promoting female science and technology talents construction give a clear policy for increasing the proportion of the female science and technology personnel, personnel and the retain to research work after the female uh, faculty. Senior female experience 
experts can choose choose uh, retirement uh, can choose retirement uh, retirement age uh, voluntary and so on. Uh, in 2004, uh, ACWF and the CSST joined, uh, established uh, the special, uh, uh, the special awards for the female, uh, young female uh, scientists of China. In 2009, CSST set up a Chinese Women Researchers Special Committee, and it also established the, the Chinese Women Researcher Labor Laboratories and constructed the Chinese Women Researchers website uh, uh, in two, 2011. And uh, in 2010, the NSFC, National Natural Science Foundation of China, uh, stated for the first time the women researchers have the priority and equivalent condition in research project reviewing in the whole process of the project reviewing by the NSFC if possible, gradually improves the proportion of women experts. The age limits from the original the 35 uh, prolonged to the 30 for the uh, female researchers to apply the uh, Young Scientist Foundation of NSFC uh, projects, and the project can extend upon the expiration, uh, expiration because the per agency and the uh, childbirth uh, burly, burly or the first uh, uh, feeding. Uh, and we also show some uh, uh, date for, uh, for, for, uh, for introducing the development the status of the Chinese female researchers. Uh, uh, on, uh, overly, until 2011, there, is, there are uh, 24.91 million female uh, researchers, uh, uh, human resources in science and technology fields, which accounts for 40 percent in China. Most of them, them receive the high level education. Master degree accounts for uh, 42 percent. Doctor degree accounts for 30 percent, and uh, uh, and. Also, it's shown the small number of the prominent fem female scientists, and all, as well as the no proportion of the uh, female science in China. And this, this, uh, these two figures show the uh, female science win the NSFC's uh, uh, National Science and Technology Awards, uh, and female science less number of the winner as well as, well as, uh, as uh, no proportion, yeah. And these figures show the famous researchers got projects funded by NSFC, uh, it's shown. And we find the main issues of the Chinese female researchers in their career development, uh, such as the lack of the systematic and the spatial incentive, uh, incentive policy uh, for female researchers, lack of working condition and environment that fits for the, uh, the, the female researchers, lack of scientific and rational evaluation mechanism uh, for their, lack of the specialized research funding mechanisms for their. Uh, in addition, and the social, couch, female, physical, uh, child-bearing, uh, family responsibility are also the important factors affect the development of the female researchers. And we also give uh, some policy suggestions for the Chinese uh, governments, uh, such as the strengthening and the implementing the research funding and the incentives policies, uh, especially the female priority at the same conditions. Support the female researchers to carry out a wide range of scientific and technology cooperation and exchanges at home and abroad, uh, promoting their integrating into the mainstream academic network, uh, strengthening the women science team building, set up a special research fans, uh, talents program, and incentive mechanism for theirs, 
establish and improve the research evaluation system and incentive mechanism prepared for the characteristics of the female researchers and also the improve the personnel system and the environment of the academic institutions to promote career development of the female researchers. That's all for my report, thank you.